Soccer Mom season. What brought me much progress obviously stems from the mindset. Why do I preach mindset so much? Why is that so important, bro? One of the most important things when it comes down to transforming your life. That's why it's so important. That's why I be talking so much when it comes down to mindset. For me, I have a warrior mindset when it comes down to training and how the way I carry myself. What do you, what, what, do, what do I mean? How I train is exactly how you want to train for battle type shit. Like it's a mindset. You feel me? Like you want to prepare for battle. Out there in this, out there in this world, bro, it's crazy. It's scary. It's a scary world to be out here, man. And I want to be on my P's and Q's. I want to be strong. I want to be physically fit, so I can defend myself or run away from any situation without being out of breath, gassed out, or just do not have the physical strength to defend myself. You can't be no weak little bitch, man. At the end of the day, your mindset will show how the way you look and talk and carry yourself. If you a bitch boy. You probably one of those motherfuckers that be on Twitter complaining about life and canceling motherfuckers because you're bored. What I call that is weak mindset where you scared of everything, don't want to take the risks, don't want to push yourself farther in life. That's what you call weak mindset. Instead, you want to be a dog, you know what I'm saying? And when it comes down to transforming your body and wanting to have that physique of a goddess or a god or just that that motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? You want to be that top G, you want to be that dog, you know what I'm saying? You ain't no weak little motherfucker. Well, you have to bust your ass. You got to train like a motherfucker and know what to do, you know what I'm saying? You got to grind your ass off. Challenge yourself like you never challenged yourself before. That's the only way you're going to improve, but it's your mindset, how the way you approach your training and how you approach life. One thing that I understand about life, man, life always been blunt to my ass, man. Like, it be busting my shit, you know what I'm saying? It hand me things that, honestly, it's almost like mini challenges for your life, you know what I'm saying? How the way you're going to respond to it. Are you going to cower away and complain about it you know what I'm saying oh this is too hard or this shit ain't fair you know this and that and this and that and this and that and you know what I'm saying and you want to stay in your little cubby hole and not go out challenge it you know challenge yourself you know there's so many things you're just not doing because you're just being a weak little bitch but when you have that mindset of being that dog bro I'm telling you you're gonna be built like a damn dog it's all about eye for an eye. It's that energy that you give. For me, I want to be built like a warrior, so I'm going to train like a warrior, think like a warrior. Because not only do you have to be physically strong, you got to be mentally tough, too. Because, man, like I said, life is crazy. It be throwing curveballs at your ass. How will you respond to it? Are you going to sit there and keep complaining like a little bitch, or are you going to fight through it? For me, I'm going to fight through it. I got handed a bunch of tests you know what i'm saying what's going to test my gangster and for me i'm not going to say a coward in one knee and just sit here and just let it all just take over me nah i'm not going to stop i'm going to keep on fighting i'm going to keep digging deep find ways to sit here and tackle on that challenge rather than man fuck it i'll just give up can't do it life is so unfair and i'm just so worthless see that's that weak ass mindset i'm talking about you already given up or you already doubting yourself from starting anything. That's what's going on to sit here and lead you to square one. You stuck because you got a weak ass mindset, bro. A warrior mindset is going to take you so far. Word should be warriors technically, right? You know what I'm saying? But our ancestors should be warriors. So why in today's world we so we just too comfortable? You know what I'm saying? Not getting any lack of, we just too lack of exercise. We're not doing anything and there's too much hate going on. Too much anxiety and fear and depression going on to even start anything. Life ain't hard. You're just making that shit hard. You're making the shit hard for yourself, man. There's so much more things to do to be complaining that, damn, I'm, my heart is broken, man. That bitch really did just cheat on me, bruh. <laughs> She didn't even love me, bruh. I see her about her flowers and candy. I took her ass out on that date, man. And she sit here play me like a little fool, bruh. Out here banging that other dude, bruh. 
told me not to worry about. Shit crazy, man, ain't it? That shit crazy. It's all right, bro. Everything's going to be all right, man. Because, like I said, you came to this channel for a reason to get motivated and understand, like, bro, we're damaged, but we're going to heal ourselves. The only way to heal is obviously we got to just do something about it. You got to do it. You got to pull through and not give up, not be a little bitch. For real. No bitch mindsets around here. Warrior mindset. The warrior mindset is going to give you all kinds of results. For real. It's going to transform you. No diet exercise is going to transform you. Your mindset will. Your mindset. See, the thing is, bro, all that shit is byproducts. Your mindset is going to lead you to get the motivation to even do the exercises. To do the diet. To go five, six days a week. On whatever you need to do. It's the mindset that's going to drive you to do what you need to do. My mindset is going to drive me to do what I need to do. It's soccer mom season. Now I'm sitting here going to sit here get all the soccer moms tweaking, bro. Like, these pictures is finna go raw. But if I want some raw-ass pictures, I got to go raw in the motherfucking gym. Eye for an eye. You feel me, bro? You can't be no weak, coward-ass motherfucker, man. Otherwise, you're not going to go nowhere, man. You got, you're just going to be stuck. And for me, I don't like being around motherfuckers like that. But I like to help them out, though. You know what I'm saying? I want to talk it through. But another thing I understand in life, man, no matter how many times I'm going to try to save a person, bro. J. Cole always told me, man, don't save her. She don't want to be saved. The same applies for a guy. That man don't want to be saved. He understand he hurting himself. That girl understands she hurting herself. But y'all keep going back to the same nonsense. And you go right back into your rooms crying to yourself talking about life ain't fair. I'm worthless. This and that. Shut the fuck up, you bitch ass nigga. That right there is the start of a new journey. A journey of a fucking warrior just been born. You finna grow into a goddamn motherfucker. Gee, you know what I'm saying? Man, I'm telling you, this year and beyond, bro, we ain't finna sit here and be depressed and cowardice. You know what I'm saying? I ain't on that shit. You got to have a strong mindset if you want to be strong. If you have a weak mindset, then you're going to be one weak little bitch. But why I be so harsh with my delivery? Because I love every single one of y'all. And you got to love you. Because nobody else going to love you more than you. Now let's get this motherfucking work.